Anytime I uh, was with him, for instance, there's pictures up here that he took with uh, my, uh, my mother-in-law, who's now almost 103 years old, and she was a Texan. And the two of them, just during this picture, they couldn't stop talking about Texas. And that's just the way he was. And I, uh, you know, especially when Mrs. Bush uh, would come in to campaign, uh, they always asked my wife, Stephanie, to, to go to the events. Uh, Georgie and Depke and a lot of the, the people that were active would, would uh, you know, have lunch with her. And uh, it was just a great uh, uh, family. I mean, everything they say about the family was just true. He was... He was very dedicated to his family, and he was just a gentleman, you know, a class act, and uh, uh, was a time in politics. If you think about it, you know, a lot of people criticize him, his one term in office, and you know, they, they point to the issue about the taxes, but a lot of times I think of it just as, you know, Reagan Bush for 12 years is what it was. It was a, and a, and a lot was accomplished. I hear people uh, the the talking heads now they say well you know he didn't really accomplish that much other than the fall of communism and the and the, and the Berlin Wall and the Soviet Union I mean that's a pretty good start and uh, you know when people s criticize him for that I think to myself well who are they comparing him to which presidents you know ha have had such accomplishments in such a short period of time I think it hurt him when he when he made that pledge and he, he went and negotiated that that uh, tax deal, but you know, people uh, don't realize that that stimulated the economy and reduced the deficit, which really uh, laid a foundation for Bill Clinton coming in.